So, hey guys, it's uh, Sister with a Testimony, and I got a surprise today um, in the regional news in the Texarkana Gazette. It's like, oh, wow. The headlines read, Woman Uses Yard Sale to Minister to People. And, um, wow. To God be the glory, right? So, on Saturday, the Lord had told me, just set up your tent, Leslie, and they will come. And not only did they come, saints, but it was phenomenal. I didn't do any advertising. I did not tell anybody I was doing this. The Lord said, set up, this, set up the tent, they will come. And I've been hearing this for a long time, and I thought, you know, I wasn't really sure what the Lord was telling me, that I, I didn't want to set the tent up and do gospel meetings and do the same old thing that people do all the time. And basically, saints, if you'll just obey God and not know what the rest of the story is, just do what He tells you to do. And this guy stopped by my yard sale. His name is Neil Abels or Abellus from the Texarkana Gazette. It's like, wow. The Lord sent him here just stopping at a yard sale and then he does a story on the ministry. I'm like, how does that work, saints? You know, it's like there's a lot of people out here. Texas once had a thousand dance halls and now there's a rush to save those that remain. Yay! Let's make them churches. But needless to say, I obeyed the Lord and I got exposure that I didn't ask for. I am not going about to make a reputation for myself. I said I'm not going to I'm not going to advertise, Lord. Whatever you want, you're going to make happen, Father God. And from this sister with a testimony to you saints with a testimony, if you will glorify the Lord, if you will obey the Lord, he is the one that will take a nobody and make them a somebody without anybody's permission. I didn't make that up. I seen it on Facebook. But I just want to let y'all know that God uses women and men and yard sales and water and food and clothing and anything that he puts his hand to, he will use to minister to people. I didn't even think about the yard sale being a ministry tool. Uh, what I wanted to do was sell stuff and, um, you know, basically raise money to go do my homeless outreach. Uh, you know, giving water to people, giving food to people. I don't have a job, I don't have money coming in, so <laughs> whatever I've got, I give away freely, but I thought, there's some really good stuff here, I can sell it and use that to go to Texarkana to minister to people. And then the guy stops and he says, so do you use this yard sale as, a, as an evangelism tool? And I said, well, I guess I do, because... I found myself, saints, praying for people and praying with people that came to the yard sale. It's just like everywhere else I go. The Lord will give me a word of knowledge and we just start talking about the Lord and things happen. There was a lot of stuff that happened on Saturday that was just so phenomenal that is not in this article. But um, I'll tell you what, woman uses yard sale to minister to people. God uses people to minister to people. 
He said, set up the tent, they'll come. They came. I'm looking forward to it this weekend and many weekends thereafter. Y'all come on by. Pray for me. Pray with me. Hey, you never know. There might just be some little treasure here. There's the coffee sign. And uh, there might be some little treasure here that you might want that will buy a case of water for some homeless people or for some people that are out working that need water in this heat. So God bless you, saints. I love you. It's ah, sister with a testimony. And I am a Christian obediently preaching salvation. Wow. Don't go about making a reputation for yourself. God will do it all on his own. You ain't got to call the newspaper. They'll just show up. So shout out to Neil. Thank you for coming by and visiting with me. And um, he didn't buy anything. But hey, this is regional news. And let me tell you what, Texarkana Gazette, this is a blessing. I love you. God bless you. It's Sister with a Testimony. Later.